I was thinking this morning about people, how they're having life struggles, how they're having difficult situations, how they're going through many problems and they're, they're facing many trials in their lives. And I was thinking about that and I was thinking, if only they knew, if only they knew where they could get that help from. If only they could find a solution to their problem. And, you know, I started to think very deeply about this because we know that in the world right now, there is many, many things going on and many problematic situations are happening right now. And so I've had many people on my heart and, you know, my heart came to the Bible scripture, Psalms 121. And it says, I lift my eyes up to the hills from where does my help come from? So where does our help come from when we are in difficulty or we're going through a situation that is working against us or we're feeling stressed, we're feeling anxious about the future? Where does our help come from? It says, I lift my eyes to the hills. Anticipating, thinking about where my help comes from. From where does my help come? That is a very powerful question. When you're in need, when you're struggling, and there's nobody else around, You can look up to the hills, you can look here, you can look there, but you know, you might be lost or scratching your head and thinking, where does my help come from? And the answer is in verse 2 of Psalms 121. It says, my help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. You see, God created all things including you and he knows about you and he knows about your situation and he wants you not to look around looking even to the hills for help but he wants you to look to him to turn to him in times of need turn to him and share your heart with him share your burdens with him because he is the creator of all the heavens and the earth. All the heavens and the earth. And he can solve your problem. He can help you find a solution. He can help you to get through to the other side. My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. Isn't that just mind blowing? You know, if God can make the heavens and the earth, then surely he can help you with your situation, your problem, the things that you're going through. But he wants you to turn to him and ask him for help. He wants you to get rid of that pride. And don't think for a moment that he's you know, not willing to help, but he wants you to come to him. And a lot of people will say, I don't really want to turn to him. I, I'll try and work this out on my own. That's pride. We must turn to God in our times of need. We must ask God to help us. To help us find a solution through the problem. Verse 3 says, He will not let your foot be moved. He who keeps 
you will not slumber. He will not let your foot be moved. That means he will not let you fall. He will not let you stumble. Whatever you're going through, God is there for you, amen. Whatever you're going through, whatever situation you're in, no matter how serious it is, turn to God, turn to Jesus Christ, and he can help you. He who keeps you will not slumber. God Almighty, Jesus Christ, never sleeps. He's on alert. He's waiting to hear from you. And he wants to help you. He may not remove that problem, but he will help you find a solution to get you through that problem. And sometimes problems can be our friend. Sometimes they can help to build our character, help to make us stronger, help to make us more wise. That's right, sometimes problems can be our friend. Like if we're about to slip somewhere on the edge of a cliff, like fear, fear can be a problem. And pro that problem can be a friend, because fear can be a friend because it alerts you to the danger and then you step forward and you're out of that danger. But if you didn't listen to that fear, which is a problem, then you may have fallen over the cliff. And I'm not asking you to listen to your fear. I'm not asking you to magnify your problem. I'm asking you to take your problem, your situation to God because he's waiting to help you. He loves you. He loves you so much. And he is there for you. He's there waiting for you. He wants to hear your heart. He wants you to share your burdens with him. He wants you to share your burdens with him because he says, for all those who are heavy and burdened, come to him and he will give us rest. Remember, you will get rest in the Lord, and the Lord God will help navigate you, navigate you through the problems, through the situations, through the seriousness, and help you to get out of the other side. It doesn't mean he'll remove the problems, but he'll help navigate through them. And you'll come out stronger at the, other, at the other end. You'll come out a lot stronger. So I hope that really encouraged you. And I, I, I really, that's what my aim is to encourage you, to equip you, to build you up and empower you by sharing God's message with you. And this message is for somebody very specific. And you know that someone could be you listening right now. So God, through me, is sending you a very powerful message. And that message is to turn to him and if you don't know Christ, then turn to him and accept him as your Lord and Savior. Submit and surrender all to him. And he will make you a new creation. You'll be born again. All, all things will pass away. And you'll become new, forgiven, truly forgiven. You see, Jesus loves us all and he wants us all to turn to him. So remember my message today. Jesus loves you and he wants you to turn to him and share your heart, share your burdens with him. And he's waiting there to help you find a solution. He's waiting there to help you through to the other side. That's all I've got to say for today. My name is Pastor Gareth from Cloud Christian Ministries. 
and I hope you have a fantastic day and I hope you take this message to heart and please do share it with some, with all your family, friends and loved ones so that they can receive this message. Maybe it's for them, maybe it's for you. God bless you all. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now. Bye bye. God bless you all.